tell when we're ready to go. We're okay, well, all right. Yeah, so we're just asking a few quick questions out here today. Okay? Um, so my first question is, would you consider yourself to be a good person? No. No? No. And wh why do you think that is? Um, well, I think I'm a bit selfish, but that's about it. Okay. Yeah. Um, I would I would have to actually agree with you because <laughs> I think that all people are not good people because we have not met God's standard of right and wrong. And God's standard of right and wrong is based on the Ten Commandments. Uh, do you think you've broken any of the Ten Commandments? No, nope, not yet. No, you don't think so? Some of them are lying. Have you lied? Just, just kidding, yes. Yeah, I have. <laughs> and and stealing? Yep. <laughs> I think I think all of us have at some point in our life lied or stealed or done both or, or more. Um, and so that's God's standard of right and wrong. What do you think God should do to people who have broken his standard? Um, I don't know. Uh, <laughs> I guess, uh, let karma take, I don't know, karma obviously will come, I don't know. What, what God says happens is that he, because he is just, he has to punish those people who've done things wrong, which is everyone, and send them to hell. Yeah, that sounds about right. You think that's just? Yeah. yeah. Okay. And it's, it is, I think it is just. But it is a very scary prospect to consider that's what God is going to do with people. But God has provided an option for uh, an atonement, which means to, instead of us taking the punishment for our sins, our wrongdoing, or breaking his standard, he sent his son, Jesus, to come to this earth. He lived a perfect life and didn't do anything wrong like none of us have done. And he died as an innocent man to atone for our sins. Have you heard about that before? Yeah, yeah, I have. Do you believe it? Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. And and it is also, the one thing it requires of us is to believe and then repent of our sins and it, it says that we'll be saved. Do you, do, have you have you done that? No. No? No. Um, do you, like, do you, if you believe in, in God and Jesus coming and our own sin, why wouldn't you uh, repent? I have no idea. <laughs> well, yeah, okay. I would, I would encourage you to think about that and to, and to really consider, if you don't have a reason not to repent, to, to repent and um, be saved, Jesus is, is, a, is an atonement for our sins and he's a wonderful person who's helping um, us not have to face the penalty of our sin and um, his, his grace is extended to everyone. So um, just uh, have you think about that. So uh, thank you for the interview and, uh, and uh, yeah, go th think about that as you go through your day. Will do.